They said, Lord, that, that even the devils. He's like, man, the devil, I'm, he's been put out. He said, behold, listen, I give unto you power, power, authority, the ability to get results. Mm -hmm. The ability to cause or prevent an action that is given to us by him. Now, do I have it? To navigate this world. Isn't that good news? Yes. We have authority. We don't always act like it though, do we? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Sometimes we're just at the mercy of the circumstances. and we... Only if we choose to. Right. Be. Right. And we... We kind of forget for a minute. We mm -hmm. do, don't we? Yeah. It's easy to do that. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. We should... Um, We should endeavor to to do this consistently yes. and be quick to recognize when we are not walking in our God-given authority and power. Mm -hmm. Quick to recognize. Yo, whoa, hold on. I'm off track. Let me get this thing steered back in. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. uh, let's pick up. <clears throat> In verse well in, in verse ten, yeah, the or chapter chapter ten, verse one. Uh if you have it, say amen. 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 Uh, after these things, the Lord appointed other 70 also. You know, we always hear, well, that was just for the 12 disciples. Mm -hmm. No, the, the Lord has, has given a lot of things to a lot of people, right? Mm -hmm. And he's given a lot of things to us. So he's, he's, Jesus is telling the uh, the seventy sent him out in pairs. Um, da, 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 da. Verse He sent them out and he, he, he had told them some things. I send you out as lambs among wolves. Um, he said in verse 9, he said, he said, and go and heal the sick that are therein into the cities that you go, the places that you go. He said, heal the sick. That was their assignment, right? Mm -hmm. Go tell the people. Bring some healing. He said there in, in verse 9, he said, uh, and, and say unto them, the kingdom of God is come nigh unto you. <clears throat> he said, go heal the sick. We have authority and we have power. We have authority because he said so. Authority is given by those in authority, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The number one authority in the in everything is the Lord, and he said so. Yes. Mm -hmm. 
right? Yes. We're authorized. Tell your neighbor, I'm, I'm authorized. authorized. I'm authorized. I'm authorized. I'm authorized. Mm. Get an inch taller and say, I'm authorized. I'm, I'm authorized. authorized. Hallelujah. Some of y'all like that, didn't you? Mm -hmm. <laughs> He said the kingdom of God has come near unto you. Who brought it? Jesus. Well, they did, right? Mm -hmm. Jesus told them to do to, right? Mm -hmm. He said, you go, go take healing and tell them mm -hmm. that the kingdom of God has come near them. Mm -hmm. Right? It was in them. It's in us. Mm -hmm. Right? This is in us. This is our authority, and this is our power. Right? Mm -hmm. We're authorized to operate and make this work. Not hope so, mm -hmm. but living in this and getting results, getting our new cars, getting our whatever. Mm -hmm. Amen? Are you with me? Mm -hmm. We're authorized. It's, it's like with the... Uh, with the policeman. He's got the authority badge, right? Mm -hmm. But he's got the gun power to back it up, right? Mm -hmm. You've got power to back this up. We don't have to throw it out there and hope so. Man, we got authority with our faith to get results. Are you with me? Yes. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Good thing I'm going to preach short tonight because y'all look tired. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Aww. Uh -huh. I don't need you to go long. That's why that you need to <laughs> press on, brother. Bring, bring it, brother John. But do you more more frequently, y'all? We got to believe in authority. There's that word. And getting our results, mm -hmm. we have the power to see this through. Let's read on. Um, tell your neighbor the kingdom of God is in me. The kingdom of God is in me. And that is evident in several places. Uh, Jesus said, um, uh, the, don't look low here or there. He said, the kingdom of God is within you. Paul said that in, in Romans 14, 17, he said that the kingdom of God is not meat and drink. He said, but it's um, it is really dude. <laughs> Joy in the Holy Ghost. Yeah. It, what does it say? Yeah, now we gotta look. I gotta see it. Enjoying the Holy Ghost. Enjoying the Holy Ghost. Love from heaven. Peace, love, peace. Something like that. Somebody help me out. Tech department's got it over there. Uh, you got it there? She's researching it. It's righteousness. righteousness. Right. right standing with God. This depends on right standing with God. Right. Romans 14, 17. Right. He said the kingdom of God, right, is not meat and drink. I got that part right. Yeah. <laughs> but righteousness, it's right standing with God. Peace. Listen, folks, when you really operate in this, you're going to have peace. Mm -hmm. right. You're not going to be all tore up. Right. When, when, think about it. When you really operate in this, you're going to have a confidence that brings peace. Mm -hmm. you're, not, you're not going to be hoping so and wringing your hands. You're going to be, you know what? The Word does what it says it'll do. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And I ain't got to worry about it. And joy in the Holy Ghost. Joy in the Spirit. I heard uh, Caroline Leaf, um, she was on, she's been on uh, Brother Copeland's show the last couple of weeks. Or maybe this week and next. Or maybe it was the last two. At any rate, she said, um, you know, and we've drawn it up here, the, the, the little concentric circles, spirit, soul, body, right? Mm -hmm. She made a good point that really hit home for me. You know, I kind of draw them equal. You know, that she said, we're 99% spirit. She said, the rest of it is just, we need to live like that. With that spiritual strength, with that spiritual perspective. Spiritual perspective is a whole different way of dealing with things. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 
Yeah, right. We don't have to freak out and and overreact or, or and, and be so sad or so angry or or worried. Spiritual perspective brings peace. Knowing that the word's going to do what it says it's going to do. That's authority and that's power. But we have both. The kingdom of God has come near you. We take in the kingdom of God to you, right? <clears throat> hmm. But in the city where you enter and receive you not, go your ways out in the street the same as say, even the very dust of your city, which cleaves on us, we do wipe off against you. He says, shake the dust off your feet. Don't fight with them if they want to. Notwithstanding, be ye sure of this, that the kingdom of God has come nigh unto you. Now, I know in, in the King James that kind of reads a little choppy, but he said, don't fight with them, but stay on your thing, right? Don't fight with them, stay on your thing. Mm -hmm. Amen. Mm -hmm. Boy, that's, I received that. Don't fight with them. Don't forget your, your position. Don't forget your perspective because in a fight, sometimes we can lose our perspective, right? Get all carried away, forget what we're doing. Don't lose your perspective. Wait a minute. Do you see that? Yeah. Uh -huh. Like it's not you and it's not the kingdom of God, it's you. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. yeah. Right, right. Uh, 13. Woe unto you, courage, and woe unto you, Bethsaida. For the mighty works have been done in Tyre and Sidon, which have been done in you. Uh, they had a great while ago repented, sitting in sackcloth and ashes. They would have recognized, mm -hmm. but you ain't recognizing. So you're not going to get it. In another place, the Lord said, I, I wanted to gather you up as a, as a hen gathers its chicks, but you wouldn't let me. You wouldn't let me. You wouldn't be receptive, right? We're going to be receptive, right? Amen. 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 We're just going to be receptive. We're going to receive what the Lord has for us. Um. 16, he that hears you, hears me. And he that hates you, hates me. And he that hates me, despises him that sent me. You see the connection Jesus makes between us, mm -hmm. him, and God. Mm -hmm. we, man, we are, we are connected. We are connected. So 17, and the 70 return... So they went out and they did and they came back with joy. They were excited. Saying, Lord, even the devils are subject unto us through your name. We need to be running off some devils, running some devils out of our lives. Mm -hmm. And recognizing some things for what they are. There's some devils trying to mess with, I mean, it, things haven't changed. Right? There's some evil spirits I'm trying to operate. Mm -hmm. Right? Yep. We just need to cast them out. Put them out. What did Jesus do? Didn't fool with them. Put them out. Are you all with me? Mm -hmm. Return with joy. See, when you get in this, it, it, man, you'll have joy. <laughs> Verse 17. Even the devils are subject unto us. They they got to do what we tell them. When I, when when I'm in in the name of Jesus, when I'm putting some evil spirit mess out, it's got to go. Amen. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Again, authority and power. See, you get you start talking about putting some evil spirits out. Well, now, brother, hold on. Let's just let's just go the other way and try to avoid. No, let's. Sometimes you can't avoid, and you just got to. Go right at it. Mm -hmm. Amen. Mm -hmm. 
wouldn't that have been better work if you actually spoke to the person who said, <laughs> Get thee behind me, Satan. Well, yeah, the Lord spoke to the devils in several, several yeah. places in, yeah. in, um, um, in the new in the gospels, oh, Jesus Peter did it. He talked to Peter. Peter. Oh, yeah, right, right, right. Yeah, because he was he was yielding to listening. right, yeah. right, okay, yeah. yeah, right, yeah, maybe not the courtroom. Um, but right outside might be okay. <laughs> but just, but just in, with yeah. confidence and with just, just devil I ain't fooling with you, right? Um, we put up with too much stuff. We have authority and power, and we put up with too much stuff. We sit in in situations and circumstances, uh, and maybe tolerate people. for two months that we ought to be done with in two days. I think sometimes we put too much focus. This is what the Lord has been revealing to me on the enemy. And we begin to behave as though he has some kind of authority or power in our life mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. when he doesn't. No, no. We, we, we'll talk about, we'll be in a situation and we'll talk about having to battle him. Mm -hmm. And the Lord showed me yesterday, we don't have to battle him. Yeah. He's already defeated. The Lord didn't spend a big, long bunch of time with, with any of the devils, did he? Uh-uh. He just I, told him what's up right. and, and that's, went on. And that's all that we need to do. Yeah is speak what the word says stay solution in that situation yes go on yes don't don't give him that's a word for that us all. time and that energy yeah. and that attention yeah. mm -hmm. speak it and go mm -hmm. eve um when she engaged with the enemy mm -hmm. her focus got in with him engaged oh well mm -hmm. No, let's mm -hmm. talk about this. Mm -hmm. God said, oh, yeah, he said, I'm sure we die. Right? Mm -hmm. And then she and she saw, she looked, and she thought, and mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Well, maybe it is. Mm -hmm. And next thing you know, she's out in the garden. Mm -hmm. And got somebody else messed up, too. We have authority and we have power. Let's see, how did Jesus handle things? Right? Let's read on. Scripture and went on. Yeah. And expected, <clears throat> when he said devil go, he expected the devil to go. Mm -hmm. He didn't open one eye and see the devil still there. Mm -hmm. He's like, man, you're gone. Because mm -hmm. I have authority. Right. Don't tolerate. Can't lose sight of that. Don't tolerate. Amen. <coughs> They returned with joy because they'd been getting results, and they said, "Lord, the devils are subject unto us through you, even the devils." Mm -hmm. And the Lord, the Lord said, "I beheld Satan as lightning fall from heaven." He's saying, "Of course they do." Mm -hmm. See, they said, "Wow, even the devil." Mm -hmm. The devil is not an equal. The devil is far below. He's defeated. Right. Okay. Right. They say, oh, even, even the devils, even the big, strong devil. Mm -hmm. No, the defeated devil. Jesus was like, no, nah, I, I didn't put him out. Don't be, and he said, don't be, don't be, mm -hmm. um, you know, in 20, he said, don't rejoice in that. Because, mm -hmm. yeah, that's not that big a deal. Of course, the devils are yeah. subject to you yeah. in his name, right? Yeah. Of course they are. How would they not be? He done kicked everybody out one time, mm -hmm. right? 19. They said, Lord, the, the, even the devils. He's like, man, the devil, I've, he's been put out. He said, behold, listen, I give unto you power 
power, authority, the ability to get results, mm -hmm. the ability to cause or prevent an action that is given to us by him. Now, do I have it? Yes. Yes, if you're a believer. Yeah. Sometimes we, we stutter or stammer or hesitate. Well, well I, I know I got it, but who gave it to you? Who has it? And who gave it to you? Mm -hmm. Man, we need to just walk right on through some stuff and don't hesitate, right? Mm -hmm. I read something in a victory magazine that said that the armor of God is all on the front of you. There's no, no, no mention of nothing yeah. on your back because you should always be moving forward. Right, mm -hmm. right. Yeah. yeah, amen. Yeah, yeah we, doesn't this make sense? Mm -hmm. Yes. We, we, he, he gave it to us. I got his power. I got a, a, a piece of God living inside of me. We do. You know, the Lord was reminding me <clears throat> the situation that happened yesterday. <clears throat> and the exact words were, there is no chance. But I remember 27 years ago when the doctor told me Zachary would never live to be born. And if he did, he would live five minutes after birth. Okay. See how that turned out. Yeah. So, no matter what the lies has been told, no matter what the circumstances, you know what, it don't matter what social, or any, it don't matter about none of that. And I needed this. I, I was praying, and I, I didn't mean to be selfish, but I was praying that no kids would show up tonight because I really needed it. Okay. Yeah. Something from the Lord. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I hope you're getting it. I am. You're getting it. Yeah. You have authority and power. And then as you said, oh boy, that they'll come with the reports. Mm -hmm. Look, verse 19. The serpents and the scorpions. Tools of the enemy, bad reports, something designed to harm you. Mm -hmm. Right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Stuff's going to come, but what does it say about the serpents and the scorpions? He said, I've given you power to walk over them, to tread on them. Mm -hmm. They're under our feet. Mm -hmm. The attempts of the enemy are to be put under our feet. Mm -hmm. Now we have to put them there. We have to do it on purpose. Yeah. Other report comes, oh, blah, blah, blah. We go, oh, no, 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 no. You will lie, Satan. Thanks be unto God who always causes me to try it, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. And what else? In every place through Christ, That's right. right? Amen. Every but we have to put it because I have authority and I have power. Mm -hmm. Right? Amen. Mm -hmm. That's he, for everybody. He gave us the authority to tra trample all over them too in bare feet. Because over here in four, it says, carry neither purse nor script nor shoes. Mm -hmm. So that means <laughs> barefoot. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Stomp you barefooted, devil. <laughs> Shows how small they are. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Excuse right. me, I gotta go. I'm sorry. Right. We love you. I love you, I love you too. Thank Catch you. us on YouTube. Okay. Yeah. Subscribe and yeah. like or like subscribe. And share. Yeah, yeah, like and share and subscribe, all that. Yeah. <laughs> okay. That verse in the Amplified says, Behold, I have given you authority and power to trample upon serpents and scorpions and physical and mental strength and ability mm -hmm. over all the power that the enemy possesses and nothing shall by any way harm you. Over all of the abilities, all of the abilities of the enemy. Mm -hmm. We have been authorized mm -hmm. to put under our feet, our bare feet. Um, We've been given that power and authorized to use it. Yeah. Power and authority over all the, the abilities of the enemy. Mm -hmm. And nothing shall by any means hurt you. Raise your hand right now. Say, Lord, I receive Lord, that. I receive the full. That and I yes, thank you for it. And we it's rest mine. in it. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. In Jesus' name, all that he has promised, all that he has done for us, 
we receive it to the full. Again, when, when we say in Jesus' name, that's what we mean. Mm -hmm. yeah. Not just the closing. Mm -hmm. It's that all that he did and all that he's promised and all that he's doing and how much he loves us, we pray and in that. We are currently in that. Mm -hmm. right. Amen. We are operating inside of that place. Yes. Amen. Mm -hmm. Right? Well, that, see, that's a different perspective. You see yourself in the power of the Lord. Right? And then and, and, and believing it and having that perspective, that mindset. Versus you go into something and say, Well, praise the Lord, we're gonna we're gonna win. And you're not really got your energy up in it. You go in that half step, and you got you man. You got to go in. <laughs> Spiritual half step. <laughs> right. He said. He said. But that's. He said. Notwithstanding, in this rejoice not, not that the spirits are subject to you. He said, but rejoice because your names are written in heaven. He's saying it's, of course, the enemies mm -hmm. under your feet. Mm -hmm. He said, man, your name's written in heaven. We have, oh, yeah. goodness, haven't yeah. we, though? Oh, my goodness, haven't we, though? Boy, haven't it's we, like though? He thought we should already know this. You know? Right. Yeah. It's, it's, yeah. it's like, well, you're my child, so everything that I have belongs to you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I, yeah, he's like, of course you, you are. Yeah. 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 Well, it, but you know, it's it's when they let the fellow down through the roof, uh, and Jesus said, y "Your sins are forgiven you." That right? Mm -hmm. Blasphemy. Mm -hmm. You know, okay, you're going to healing, but you can't forgive sins, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. And we we got it backwards now, right? right. Of course you can forgive sins, but not healing, brother. Hold on. Because that's how he was going to receive everything yeah. that was available right, to him. Right, right. So today is totally turned around. Mm -hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Good points. 21. Now, now look at this. In that hour, Jesus rejoiced in the Spirit. Hallelujah. Mm, come on, somebody. Mm-hmm. Jesus rejoiced in the spirit because they were understanding. Rejoiced in the spirit. Oh, y'all ain't hearing that. Mm. Yes, I am. And then he started talking to Father. He said, I thank you, Father. You've hid these things from the wise and prudent. And reveal them unto babes. <laughs> to those of us who are willing. To those of us who will. Believe and receive. It's for us. Right? And the more we. You know he's a rewarder of, of those who diligently seek. And the more we seek to understand this and operate in it, he adds to. He adds to, and that's that's the reward. I wonder why it says hidden from the wise and prudent. I think that was the self, the I self wise, the, our own knowledge. Self well, and, and and not only that, like a college professor now, right. who has a high right. uh, grade point average or whatever, but he looks down on the. The Christian thing in the Bible. Well, that's just a mere book, and that's right. just one theory. And mm -hmm. but for those of us who say, "Oh no, this is where it's all at," right? right. right? Yeah. That's that right because because you know, all of us are are very smart too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, right. We're we're wise and prudent, right. but we we got this too. Amen. Right. And this makes us more wise and prudent. Right. Well, but the, the Pharisees and the scribes and, and the head, in, I mean, before Jesus died, you know, the, the people were not allowed to go into that innermost heart, right. heart, the holy of holies. Only the priests could go right. in there. Right. You know. Yeah. Yeah, we'll come out and tell you what, right. what God said. Right. right. But 
not anymore. No. Because it has been revealed to us. Yeah. And we have that personal well, when, when connection Je Jesus, with him. When, when Jesus um, uh, died, said the temple veil was rent from top to bottom, mm -hmm. tore from top to bottom, God tore it and said, okay, you come in now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Amen. Where are we at? Ooh, thank you, Lord. Yes, thank you, Lord. I can come boldly before you. Right. Amen. To obtain. Right. To help in time of need. Amen. Um, okay. 23 told the boys, Blessed are the eyes which see the things that you see. If I tell you, many prophets and kings have desired to see those things that you see and have not seen them, and to hear the things which you hear and have not heard them. Listen, we seeing it, and and we seeing it, and we hearing it, right? Yeah. And we taking it to the full. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> um. Good Samaritan. A certain lawyer, a man of the law, 25, stood up and tempted the Lord, trying, trying to manipulate him. I mean, if you know, there ain't no manipulating the Lord. Amen. But I, I'm, I'm, I'm glad of that because, you know, we can just go and, and say, Lord, I missed it. Instead of going, well, Lord, that woman that you gave me, you know, making excuses, right? right. Mm -hmm. um, say, Master, what shall I do to inherit eternal life? Now, he wasn't trying to get get an answer. He was, he was, he was tempting Jesus. Mocking. Yeah, trying to kind of mess with him. <clears throat> Jesus said, "Was written in the law." Now, see. Jesus was addressing this because in that moment, current, the law was in place, right? Mm -hmm. And this man wasn't trying to get, he was trying to be slick, mm -hmm. trying to go, uh, try, trying to get something where he oh, Jesus, you're wrong, let me tell you. Yeah. You missed it here, yeah. sir. Here's yeah. what, it ain't never happened. Um, he said, well, what's written in the law? How do you read it? He said, love the Lord our God with all your heart soul, strength, and mind, and your neighbor is yourself. And Jesus said, you've answered right. Do this and you'll live. But he, willing to justify himself, said to Jesus, and who is my neighbor? <laughs> See, trying to be slick. Mm -hmm. And Jesus answered, said, a certain man went down from Jericho, fell among thieves, stripped him of his raiment, wounded him, departed, leaving him half dead. By chance came down a certain priest, a religious guy. Um, when he saw him, when he saw him, he passed by on the other side. Yeah, we ain't gonna go there. Um, Thirty-two. <laughs> well, well, religion, that religion will step back and tell you how bad you are. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Come on, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Religion will tell with you, brother. You just. We'll try and help you. So, anyway. Likewise, a Levite, when he was on, on the place, came and looked on him and passed by on the other side. Same deal. Mm -hmm. See, religion just shows you where you're missing it. Where you're wrong, where you're sick, where you where you're broken. But certain Samaritan, uh, as he journeyed, came um, came by and had compassion on him. Who else do we know that's compassionate? Jesus, the Lord. And he went to him. He didn't pass by the other side. He went to him. Religion passed several of us by, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The Lord came to us. Right when they when religion was telling you you old sorry sinner you 
you you gonna burn the lord james said now come on let me come on let's let's get this let's heal you let's help you right are you with me mm -hmm. Bound up his wounds, yes he did. Mm -hmm. Pouring in oil and wine, healing. Set him on his own beast. Brought him to an end and took care of him. Took care of him. Lord will take care of us. And the next day when he departed, he took out two pence, gave him to the host and said, you take care of him. See, Lord paying the price for mm -hmm. us. And whatsoever you spend more, when I come again, I'll, I'll pay it. The Lord will cover it. The Lord's got us covered. Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen. He loves us. Loves us. The Lord tells us that we're valuable. See, the, the, the religion said, oh, too bad for you. Mm -hmm. But the Lord picked because we're valuable. Mm -hmm. And he took us in. He said, make sure he's okay. Whatever it takes. Because they're valuable. Right? Jesus said, now, which of the three do you think, Mr. Smart Guy, was neighbor unto him that fell among the thieves? And he said, he that showed mercy. See, he done backed that boy in the corner who was trying to be slick. The Lord gives the one who had mercy. And the Lord said to him, go and do likewise. You can't cross up Jesus. You cannot cross up the word. Right? Well, the word says. And then they're misquoted or something. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Say. Yeah, right. Mm -hmm. Right. Thirty-eight now it came to pass as they went and he entered a certain village, and a certain woman named Martha received him into her house. She has a sister called Mary, which also sat at Jesus' feet and heard his word. Amen. Amen. She said, here's an opportunity. Let me sit down and pay attention. Let me take this in. But Martha was cumbered about much serving. I got to read you what the Amplified says about this. Okay. Because this is real easy for me to get right here if I'm not being mindful of it. It says, but Martha, overly occupied and mm. too busy, mm. was distracted uh. with much serving. Uh. Overly occupied and distracted with much serving. Now she wasn't out back smoking weed, right? Mm -mm. She was in there with them making sandwiches trying to get right she wasn't doing wrong but man she was missing out wasn't she because she was too busy and occupied distracted. and distracted mm -hmm. yep. yep don't let that be us and she said lord don't you care see that's what happens when we get distracted and, and, we try to blame it on focus, and we get our focus off mm -hmm. and you say, Lord, why aren't you helping me with this? Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's a good question. And if you Amen. listen real close, you can hear him say, I gave the power and authority yeah. to you to take care of that. Yeah, I why am aren't you taking you. care of it? Okay? Yeah. Like in. you just trying to fight. Um, the, the devil tried to make that sickness or something come on you. Lord, why aren't you healing me? Mm -hmm. Why aren't you receiving your mm -hmm. healing? Why aren't you healing me? I did. Exactly. I did. Exactly. You got it. You're not applying it. Exactly. And I am helping you. Yes. I've been trying to remind you every 10 minutes mm -hmm. for the last five days to do this, do this, mm -hmm. do this. Right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now, when you, if, you, if you find yourself saying, Lord, don't you care? Boy, you may need to be doing something wrong. Yeah, <laughs> right? yeah, yeah. My wheels are completely off. Right. Yeah. Lord, um, you should not know what they're even saying. Well, we get so busy. <laughs> well, hopefully we yeah, won't go that far back. But right? you get sidetracked. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. 
But we do get busy and go, you know, why? Why ain't this working? Yeah. Well, your focus is off. Right. It's on what's going on instead of yeah. on him. Yeah. Yes. My, my sister's left me. <laughs> Tell her to come and help me. There comes that strife. <laughs> right. Yeah, I'll try yes. to come in too. There comes that strife. Uh-huh. Yeah. yeah, let's add some strife to it. Yeah. They will say, here, let, let me help you be more distracted. Yeah. You get mad at so-and-so mm -hmm. and... Mm -hmm. Start taking a tone on you. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> exactly, right. Bradley. Yeah. Boy, the word's true, isn't it? Mm-hmm. And, and Jesus answered... She said, Lord, don't you care? Tell her to come and help me. <laughs> he said, Martha, Martha, you are full of care and troubled mm -hmm. about many things. Mm -hmm. But you. one thing is needful. Go ahead and underline that. And Mary has chosen that good part which mm -hmm. shall not be taken away from her. She was at the feet of Jesus listening to his word. Mm -hmm. at, his, at his feet means she was focused, mm -hmm. listening to the word. Right? And he said, that won't be taken away. Mm -hmm. And he was showing Martha, that's the important thing. That's the needful thing. Is make sure it makes hear what I'm telling you. Hear the word, know the word, focus on the word, not sandwiches. Mm -hmm. Amen. Mm -hmm. That that was the time to hear the word. How many of us don't carve out the time? You know, we did our our uh, vision boards and spiritual goals was one of my topics. How many of us don't carve out the time, right? And we're all guilty, right? And Lindsay raised her hand, so yeah, me too. Um, we don't carve out the time, we don't make the time for that needful thing. And we say, oh, I'm so busy. Oh, I do this and that and the other, and this, call and that, and oh, blah, 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 blah. I think too it takes a focus like I'm not in the back of the line you're doing what you gotta do but you're still focused somehow mm -hmm. and you get it you we can meditate you guys are all day you know no yeah, matter what sure, you're doing you're sure, staying focused sure not just that the one focus you know full focus mm -hmm. gets you set to be Tune in all day. And, well, and, and that that I was going to make yes, yeah. that point. Yeah, we need to start our day. Right. You know, so well, I'll do it today when it, whenever it's convenient for you. Yeah. I, you know Seven what? Times. I think we need to start our day with it. Yes. So that I can have that perspective going through the day. Yes. Um. Oftentimes I do it. Sometimes I don't. And I can feel the difference. Yes. As we're talking about it, it's clear to me. Yeah, mm -hmm. I, I'm not as as dialed in. Yep. Um, so let's 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 do what's needful in our day. Mm -hmm. You know, we sit here giving Martha a hard time, <laughs> right? Yep. Let's do what's needful in our day, so that we can operate in the fullness of our authority and our power. On a daily basis. Mm -hmm. Jesus said, Seek ye first what? Kingdom of God. God. And all these things be added unto you. Mm -hmm. And he went on to say, Don't worry. He said, There's enough going on in today. He said, Focus on today. There's enough going on. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Don't worry about tomorrow. Don't regret the past. The needful thing. So we can, I can take from that that I need to do it every day mm -hmm. um, to set the tone for my day. Mm -hmm. Maybe you do too. Mm -hmm. Probably you do. Mm -hmm. And one of the reasons that it's a needful thing is so that 
when you go through your day and the enemy throws stuff at you, mm -hmm. tries to and throw stuff, stuff will, at stuff's you. And stuff's going to happen. You know what to do with that stuff. Yes. Mm -hmm. You know? Yeah. You're quicker to make I, the correct spiritual mm -hmm. decisions. I rebuke you, Satan. This situation is fine. <coughs> Everything is just like it needs to be in Jesus' name. And go I'm on. stronger to do that when I've started right. my day. Right. right. Exactly. Because right. you're already kind of <clears throat> I've set my mm -hmm. thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Right, mm -hmm. and I'm I'm stronger to recognize and and reject the things of the enemy, mm -hmm. replace it with the right mm -hmm. thoughts, being spiritually minded and, and right perspective of victory, so that we can operate in the fullness mm -hmm. of the authority. Mm -hmm. Going through my day. Hmm. As the victor. Yeah. In authority. In with authority. power. Mm -hmm. Everybody say in authority. In authority. In authority. With power. With, with power. power. Amen. That's how we're going to live. Mm -hmm. that, that's God's will for us. Yeah. So that whatever comes, I can say. Uh, mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. So get behind me, say, exactly. keep moving. I rebuke you. Instead of putting too much time on the problem. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's what it's coming to church for, wasn't it? Yes, amen. Luke 10.